What's up everybody and welcome back to another Roblox video and today's video is a bit of a part two from the last video and that is because a lot of you have been commenting about the textures failing to upload when you upload of them in the texture um, manager and in this video I'm going to be going over the most common reason why it is not working so let's get started. All right, so I'm not going to be going over everything that I did in my last video. If you guys want to see everything else about how to upload realistic textures to Roblox, then go watch that video. This video is just how to fix the problem with the textures not being able to upload. So a lot of you have been saying that they're not being able to upload and that's most likely due to the file size. So here's the website that I get my um, textures from just like in the last video. But today I'm going to be using a texture that I have never used before and that is the roofing tiles 014B with light damage. And in that last video I made I showed you that I downloaded the 2K PNG which is 53 megabytes. But from now on, you're probably going to have to download the 2K um, JPEG, which is, as you can see, a lot lower in file size. So go ahead and choose your texture. Um, there are certain textures that I'll put on screen now that I do not recommend that you upload to Roblox because they will just simply not work. But like I said, go ahead and download one of the textures that is mainly used in Roblox like wood, stone, um, brick, something like that and download the 2k JPEG and then I'll see you all over in studio. Alright so here we are in studio and as you can see I have the material manager tab already open and I have two um, parts here. One is going to be for the roof te texture and the other is going to be for a wood plank texture that I downloaded earlier. Now I am going to put a clip on screen now of me trying to upload a texture that is above the file size that Roblox requires. And as you can see in that clip it says that it failed to upload because of the file size. So now I'm going to show you guys what it's like to um, upload the 2k jpeg versions so just like in my last video like i said if you want to go back and just watch everything else besides the failing to upload part then please i recommend doing that but what you want to do is you want to pick the material that you want to add from in this case i'm just going to choose a random one i'm just going to use brick for the roof texture i'm going to hit the plus and that's going to create a variant and then in here is where I'm going to put the color, normal, and roughness. So I'm going to do the color first. And you see, go and find your texture. And we got the color here. It does take a little bit to upload. And when it does upload, as you can see, it's going to have a yellow triangle. When it's, and it says, fail to insert asset, asset ID to asset manager. Just ignore that. If you really want that off, just close and open up the tab and it'll be gone. And as you can see, it is uploaded and everything. Now, I don't have this kind of texture, so I'm going to go on to the normal. It's going to be normal GL. Upload that. And again, the yellow triangle, but we can just ignore that. Going straight to the roughness. Going to go and upload that as well. And there we go, roughness has been uploaded. And now we can select our part and we can go and hit apply. As you can see, it is now on there and it is uploaded. So now I'm gonna move on to a different texture just to show you guys that this should be the um, correct way to do it using the 2K JPEG and not PNG just because of the larger file size. So I'm going to go 
I'm going to do planks at the plus. And then I'm going to go find my planks color. Go straight to the normal. And roughness. And I'm just going to let those upload now. And there we go. As you can see, there's no thing that says fail. There's all just uh, the yellow triangles, which open and close and they're gone. Now I can select my parts and apply. And there's my wood plank texture. So that's all I have for this video. I really hope this helped all of you out with the troubles that you've been having. And I am very sorry for delaying this video for over a month now. I should have done it a lot sooner. Just been, been busy with a lot of stuff. But like I said, hopefully this helped you. If you have any questions about anything about this video or about my previous video about the realistic textures, please leave a comment down below. And it really help if you leave this video a like that shows that you're supporting me and you'd like to see more of these videos. Any, and if you have any ideas for future videos, please let me know down in the comments below and I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.